hello guys welcome back to my channel so today we are going to make this cute little fish so what what you're gonna need is you'll need two kinds of yarn one for the tail and the fin and one for the body and also you if this one is optional you can uh, have the black and white yarn for the eyes so I used the chunky yarn as you can see uh, I don't know if you can see well enough I used the chunky one and then I used a crochet hook which is uh, 4.0 millimeters and also you'll need a needle to attach all your parts together okay so let's get started okay so we're going to start with the body and first we're going to start with the magic ring and then six single crochets into the magic ring so we're going to do one two three four five and six okay and then i'm going to pull my arm to close the gap okay so now in the second row we are going to increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches okay so we're going to go into the next stitch and increase And we are also going to increase in the next stitch. Okay. And increase also in the next one. Okay. And increase also in the remaining three stitches. Okay, so now in the third row, uh, we're going to do single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, then increase in the next stitch. And we are going to keep repeating that single crochet and increase. Okay, single crochet, increase, okay, so repeat that all the way round. Okay, so now in our fourth row, uh, we're going to do two single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 24 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet one, two, and increase in the next stitch and keep repeating that so two single crochet and increase okay and repeat that all the way round okay so now in our fifth row uh, we're going to do three single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 30 stitches so we're going to do a single crochet one two three and increase and we're going to keep repeating that so three single crochets and increase okay and repeat the same pattern all the way to the end okay so now in our sixth row we are going to do four single crochet then increase and repeat all the way for a total of 36 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four and increase and keep repeating that for single crochet and increase 
and you repeat the same pattern all the way to the end okay so now in the seventh row we are going to do five single crochet then increase and repeat all the way around so we're going to do single crochet one two three four five and increase and then we'll keep repeating that so five single crochets two three four five and increase okay and you repeat that all the way round okay so now in our eighth row uh, we're going to crochet six single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 48 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three four five six increase then repeat one two three four five six and increase okay so repeat that all the way round okay so now in our ninth row we are going to do seven single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round so we do one two three four five six seven and increase and we'll keep repeating that seven single crochets two three four five six seven and increase okay and repeat that all the way round okay so now in our tenth row we're going to start decreasing so we're going to do seven single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way round for a total of 48 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four five six seven and decrease so we're going to go into the front loop pull through and the back loop of the next stitch pull through and pull through all the three loops together and then we'll repeat again so seven single crochet one two three four five six seven and decrease again okay and you're going to keep repeating that all the way round okay so now in our 11th row we're going to do single crochet all the way round for a total of 48 stitches so we'll do single crochet single crochet and we'll continue okay so you continue doing single crochet all the way to the end okay so now in our 12th row we are going to do six single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 42 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four five 
fix and decrease. And then we'll keep repeating that. So six single crochets, two, three, four, five, six, and decrease. Okay, and then you're going to keep repeating that all the way round. Okay, so now in our 13th row, we are going to do single crochet all the way around for a total of 42 stitches. Okay, so we're going to continue and do single crochet, single crochet, single crochet, single crochet, and you continue, you're going to continue doing single crochets all the way to the end. Okay, so now in our 14th row, uh, we're going to do five single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 30 stitches So we'll do single crochet one Two three four Five and decrease And we'll keep repeating that so five single crochets and decrease okay and repeat the same pattern all the way to the end okay so now in our 15th row we're going to do four single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way round for a total of 30 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four and decrease and we'll keep repeating that four single crochets and decrease okay and continue like that all the way round okay so now in our 16th row uh, we're going to do single crochet all the way round for a total of 30 stitches so we continue and do single crochet single crochet okay and continue doing single crochet all the way round okay so now in our 17th row we're going to do three single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way round for a total of 24 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three and then decrease and we'll keep repeating that so three single crochets and decrease okay and you repeat that all the way round okay so now in our 18th row we're going to do single crochet all the way round for a total of 24 stitches so we continue and do single crochets okay and you continue doing single crochets all the way round okay so now in our 19th row we are going to do two single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way round for a total of 18 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two and decrease okay and then we'll keep repeating that so two single crochet and decrease okay and repeat the same all the way round okay so as you can see i've already started stuffing my fish so you should do that too so now for the 20th row which is the last row of the body 
we're going to do single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 12 stitches okay so we'll do single crochet and decrease okay and we continue doing that so single crochet and decrease single crochet decrease and you continue the same pattern all the way to the end so after that you just cut off the yarn but before that I'm going to go into the next stitch and slip stitch okay and then I'll cut off my yarn and leave a tail long enough for sewing okay so when you're done stuff your fish fully and then after that we're going to start making the tail okay so for the tail we are going to start with six single crochets into the magic ring so I already did that and I'm going to use this bright pink yarn so you can use another color or you can still use the same color if you like so now in the second row we're going to increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches okay so we'll increase and increase the next stitch too Okay, and you're also increasing the remaining three stitches okay so now in our third row we are going to do single crochet then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches so we'll do single crochet and increase and repeat that single crochet increase single crochet increase okay and continue like that all the way round okay so after that now in our fourth row we are going to do single crochet all the way round for a total of 18 stitches so we'll continue and do single crochet single crochet single crochet okay and you'll continue doing single crochets all the way round okay so now in our fifth row we are going to do two single crochet then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 24 stitches so do single crochet one two and increase and then we'll keep repeating that so two single crochets increase okay and repeat that all the way round okay so now in our sixth row we are going to do three single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 30 stitches so we do single crochet one two three then increase and we'll keep repeating that so three single crochets three and increase okay so repeat the same pattern all the way round okay so now in our seventh row uh, we're going to do four single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 36 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four and increase and we'll keep repeating that so four single crochets and increase 
okay so you keep repeating that all the way round okay so now after that now that was our last row so i'm going to remove my marker so after i remove my marker i'm going to join the two parts together like that so in a um, semicircle as you can see and then after that we are going to do single crochet in both sides okay so i'm going to go into the first side and the second side and i'm going to do single crochet and then i'm going to continue into the next and do single crochet okay and we'll continue all the way to the end Okay, so when you get here at the end, we are going to do single crochet and then I'm going to do a chain one and cut off my yarn. Okay, and then we'll do the finishing later. So this is how our tail is supposed to look like. So we'll attach it here on the fish like that when we are going to attach all the parts together. Okay, so now I'll show you how to make the fin. Okay, so the fin is quite easy. We are going to make two of them. So you, I'll show you how to make one and then you'll make the other one. So we're going to start with the magic ring. And then we'll do a chain two. So we'll do chain one and two. And then we'll do three double crochets into the magic ring. Okay, so we'll do double crochet one. Okay, another double crochet, two, and the last double crochet, three. Okay, and then I'll pull my yarn to close the gap here of the magic ring. Okay, and then after that, I'm going to do a chain one and turn around. So when we turn around, I'm going to increase in every stitch okay so I'm going to do two single crochet in the first stitch and do two single crochet in the next and continue doing two single crochet in the next one okay and two single crochet in the last stitch okay and then after that i'll just do a chain one and cut off my yarn okay so this is how our fin is supposed to look like and you're supposed to make two of them and the two we are going to attach them here at the side of our fish okay so now we'll attach all the parts together and do the finishing okay so guys as you can see i've already finished attaching all the parts together so for the fins i attach them from the one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven on the 11th row from the front and same on the other side okay and as you can see here my little tail that's how i attached it okay so for the tail you have to attach it along the gap that you left on the body and attach it all the way around 
so that it looks like that and for my eyes what i did is i used the black and white yarn so for the black yarn i did six single crochet into the magic ring and then in the second row i used the white yarn and then i increased all the way around for a total of 12 stitches okay so it's just two rows one black and one white same with the other side and then for the little mouth i embroidered here using the pink yarn as you can see okay so guys i hope you enjoyed this pattern and you have if you have any questions you can ask in the comments below and also please check out my other videos and subscribe to my channel until next time Bye.